Storyteller, a book about building stories. <laughs> the King. Sick. Cyclic, mutually toxic love affair. Oh, wow. This is this is such a such a title to put together. Cyclic, mutually toxic love affair. Okay. Um so they're in love, they fight, one gets amnesia. They fight. We'll get her amnesia. They love each other again. <laughs> or do they fight again? No, that doesn't solve anything. They love each other. Does he get amnesia too? <laughs> yeah, we gotta give both of them amnesia. What a wild ride. Is, I love you. Fuck you. I don't know what happened. I love you. I hate you. Double execution. Oh, we have an affair with the maid. Yeah, just your average married couple. That's a sequel to 50 First Dates. Oh my goodness. All right, King, the Queen, and her in the bushes. She executes. Oh, Queen. Nope, nope, nope. We misclick. That's a misclick if I ever saw one. Okay, she sits on there. She goes away. And then we get the King not there. Where the king takes revenge now means the king sits on the throne and kills the queen. That was easy. The king having an affair with the wife is pretty funny, though. I mean, yeah, it is pretty funny. Three heads. Roll. The misclick made it funnier. It happens. Ugh. Yeah, sometimes I think I have everything under control and then my mouse is just like hey you're corded and don't you miss having a wireless one for work even though wireless mouses also are trash sometimes this is what i get for buying a cute mouse from amazon that lights up three heads roll are we having two affairs or somebody gets kidnapped no somebody gets kidnapped okay and the Baron... The queen is kidnapped by the Baron. Ah, okay, we have an affair. Um, the knight saves the queen. The affair happens with the queen. The knight, the king sees it. We execute the Baron, the King executes the Knight, and then the King. Yeah, we got the Baron back. Try switching the King and the Queen in the last story. I want, you want to see if the same result happens? Double execution. Oh, okay. I see what you're doing. No, it doesn't happen because they've drawn that line where the queen doesn't love the maid. Yeah. It's just disapproval. Uh, she's like, yeah, I, I could kill you. And he's like, yeah, don't worry. I love you. We're totally fine. And she's sweating buckets. So this is how it goes. I know. It's sad. Three you can't always get what you want. Ro Rags to royalty. Rags to ro- Oh, the maid gets married. Okay, I see this. Um, 
but there's a version where somebody gets kidnapped. Okay, um, let's see. The queen sees the affair. I don't think this is necessary, actually. The queen kidnaps the maid. No. We don't have a kidnapping yet. Okay. Or, no, there's a kidnapping that happens because the queen sees the affair. Correct? Oh, correct. I would think so. Yeah, kidnapping. Done. King saves the maid. Executes the queen. Marries the maid. Yeah. <laughs> but if you try sometimes, you just might find you get what you need. Yes, Sam. Exactly. I'm glad you figured it out. Okay. And there's not even an alternative to this. Amazing. Baron rules alone. I love it. Baron rules alone. Wedding. Cliff. Someone brought a cliff. Yes, KP, somebody brought a cliff. I, I think I am killing it. it is, we're doing pretty good. Um, how do we get him to rule alone? Do we kill the maid too because the maid has to go? Oh, wait, no. We would have to literally kill everybody. Yeah, she's kidnapped. He has to rule. Oh, I, I, okay, now I get it. She gets kidnapped. <laughs> they get married. Not right. <clears throat> Let's her out. Let her out. He's dead though. That's it, just marry her already. And have the maid marry the king? Oh, but then they're both gonna have to kill someone. Yeah, the Baron would have to marry the maid. So it still gets kidnapped somehow. <laughs> still kill the queen. Perhaps. Like, I see where you're getting at. Um, king dies. rejection on both sides.
green dice first. Baron can't marry the king. King marries the maid. Oh. saves her. I don't know. Did the queen <gasps> kidnap her? No, the queen's dead. <gasps> oh, we do kill her, don't we? We do kill her. Okay. Everybody had to die. Does there have to be a kidnap? I thought there had to be a kidnap. Because, you know, it does, like, just ruling alone doesn't necessarily mean you have to kill everybody. But I guess kidnapping means that they're still around. So they have to die. Yeah, we just have to kill everybody. It's fine. This game is totally pro murder in, like, the slightest way possible. So everybody just gets pushed off a cliff with a knife. I guess you can bring a knife to a cliff fight. Monsters! Ooh, we got monsters now. Bernard drinks poison. Okay. I mean, he has to have a reason to drink poison. <laughs> Oh, no, okay. We get the moon to turn him into a werewolf. That's neat. Um, they like each other. He turns into a werewolf. Scares her. I, too, drink energy drinks. Drinks the poison. <laughs> oh, that's horrible that I laughed at that. It was just, it's this. It's this part for me, guys. It's just this. How among us is this? Right? Yeah, Bernard, why you do this? I don't know, man. He's just, he gotta be a werewolf. Sometimes you gotta kill people like this. Yeah, Among Us. It's, it looks very Among Us to me. He was the imposter, it seems. Very much the imposter. This lo looks, this really, like, reeks of hide-and-seek for me. Pet comes back to life to enact revenge. Pet comes back to... Okay, so a dog has to die first. And we got this evil lady. Hmm. Aftermath in a nutshell. Um, comes back to life to enact revenge. So the dog doesn't like the girl. I know, right? This is what I'm so lost about, Sam. 
No, he's not having an affair with the dog, but like, you need a reason for someone to die, right? Like, he is the wolf, but no, we don't have the... We don't have that part of this game where the moon, like, like in the last chapter, we don't the have Nod this moon thing to turn poison. him into a werewolf. Pet so, comes back to life to enact revenge. Yeah, we need the pet to come back to life, but we need the dog to die somehow. Like they have an affair later, I guess. And the revenge would be like pushing her off the cliff, I bet. I don't, I mean, I wouldn't know if it was as the werewolf, but we just need some death to happen, don't we? Get the trust from the dog? No, it doesn't like the dog. No, doesn't push the dog off the cliff. would have to be she dies unless she's the one that pushes no they're cool what if Bernard sees that she doesn't like the dog but that doesn't We need to figure out how the dog comes back to life to enact revenge. She doesn't push him off the cliff because they're cool. She doesn't like the dog. He won't do anything to her. Yeah, because seeing that he doesn't like the dog is different. But coming back to life and the dog enacting revenge. Does she kill Bernard? That's what I thought. But the, I... Yeah, like... <clears throat> But killing the girl has to happen in some way where... Because I don't know that the dog... Like, the dog is coming back to life for revenge. So, the lady killing the dog obviously makes sense. But... It doesn't look like... That's happening. I think we've already done that, Pat, because seeing the affair happen and them coming back to life, like, there's... First guy and girl are together. Second, she sees him cheat with a dog. Like, they're not in love. That's the thing. Like, Bernard loves his dog. So... He's not phased by that. Like, she likes him. Yeah. But she can't push the dog off the cliff. Yeah, there's, there's still nothing that would happen with a revive. Like, even with her in the bush. Still doesn't do anything. Oh, okay, yeah, it does happen. But the revive happens too soon. That's how that's supposed to happen. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I guess it looks like it is an entire affair. Queen gets Baron arrested. Why isn't there a back one? 
Yeah, the Baron did nothing wrong. Yet. Um... <sighs> the Baron was framed? I don't know. I don't know. Um... How do we get the Baron arrested? The ballroom is just here. We can't have someone in the portrait. There's nothing wrong that happens in any of these frames. Does he put on the disguise? Ah. He puts on the disguise. <laughs> she goes to the detective about the thing. Detective finds the costume is missing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Coffee's kicking in. We're doing the thing. It's happening. It's really happening, you guys. Hi, Andrew. Thank you. Hope you're having a good hair day, too. The thing was did. It is a cute game. I really like this game, honestly. Now that I actually get how the story is supposed to work with some of the characters since, like, we first played this, I really like it. If only YouTube prank channels got arrested like this. I know. It would be so much more wholesome instead of, you know, like, everybody sitting there and it's, like, the end of the world, but it also looks like you're on punked. I have no hair, so, well, I hope your scalp is doing good. Cured or like you're just doing good in general. Good afternoon. Good evening. Good, good day. Cured of vampirism. Oh, we have John, Nina, and Dracula. Nice. Um. Who's John? Is John afraid of people? What name is Vina? I don't know. Do we cure Dracula of his vampirism? Professor, you mean where she finds Dracula? Uh, they both sleep. Um, he has to find her. Really, 
Does she die? No, she doesn't die. <coughs> oh, and kill Dracula? Just kill Dracula? Oh, right. Hey, okay. Yeah, so Mina had to be with the professor when he died, and then she's cured. Somebody had to witness her actually becoming human again. Monster is slain. that works okay um to tell us how Deserved. The Baron got what was coming to him. Monster is slain. Page, please. I don't need the end of the book, thank you. Drama. I just want to do the professor oh, thing. Monster is oh, slain. Oh, werewolf dies. This makes more sense now. Now we get to do this one. We kill the werewolf now, okay. So, no disguise. But... The werewolf has to die because he's dressed disguise right maybe no he gets scared um get the disguise away no and then see the werewolf that's what i'm thinking Oh. 
did nothing wrong. The werewolf did nothing wrong. Poor Bernard. Yeah, poor Bernard. Yeah, that little puppy noise. 